Hey you guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to do Control F on an iPhone. You may be wondering if you're able to search for a specific word or phrase on the web or on a document of some sort. On most computers, what you can do is use a keyboard shortcut by hitting Control and F on your keyboard, but obviously with an iPhone, you don't have that keyboard to, to use that shortcut. However, there are still ways to do a Control F um, on an iPhone, and I'm going to go through those with you right now. First, I'm going to show you how to do this on Safari. Once the web page loads, you're going to select the URL at the bottom here, and then click on it like this. Then you're going to type in the word that you want to find, and then you're going to scroll down to the bottom here, and, and you'll find on this page with it says four matches, and you're going to select this. This is going to find that word that you were looking for, a word or phrase. You can go through all of the options there. So there's the up and down arrow here. If I click down, it's going to go to the next word or phrase I was looking for, and so on and so forth. So first we're going to click the share button here, and then we're going to scroll down until we find the find on page option here. We'll select this, and it's going to do that same thing for us. And then we're just going to click done when we're finished. Hey, if you're finding this video helpful, you can also support the channel through super stickers. These basically just help fund the channel and it helps us continue to create content for you guys. Thanks so much. And let's get back to the video. Next, I'm going to show you how to do the same thing on Google Chrome. Once it's loaded, we're going to go to the bottom right of the screen and select the three dots. Then we're going to scroll down until we find the find in page option here and we're going to search the word or phrase that we want. And just as before, we have the upwards arrow and downwards arrow in which we can move through all of the phrases and words that it found for us. Next, I'm gonna show you guys how to do this on a PDF document. And to do this, you'll have to have the Adobe Acrobat Reader downloaded. So we're going to launch the app and then open up the PDF document that we want to look through. We're going to go up to the top of the screen and select the magnifying glass here and it's going to bring up a search bar where we can find in document and this is where we're just going to type in the word or phrase we want so it's going to highlight um, that word or phrase for us and then on the right hand side we have our forward and backwards arrow and this is going to take us through all of those words or phrases throughout the document this uh, these steps are really similar to the ibooks app on the iphone as well if we went into the books app, we can do the same thing. So you can always open up a PDF on here or even search through your books by tapping on the screen and then clicking on that search bar again, you would type in the word or phrase and it's going to show all of the phrases um, and words that we typed in through here. And we can just scroll through and click on whichever one we want. And it's just going to highlight that for us. And lastly, I'm going to show you guys how to do this in your messages. I find this one to be super useful. Sometimes you don't want to be scrolling through your messages to find a certain one. And so you can search the key phrase or word. So we're going to launch our messages. We're going to open up our messages. And then from the top, we're going to slide down. This is going to bring up a search bar here where we can search in our keyword. And it's going to bring up any messages um, that include this word or phrase. You can click see all and it's going to show you all of these messages that you have. Alrighty, you guys, that's it for today's video. I hope that you found this information helpful and useful to you. Thanks so much and I will see you guys in the next video.